there's probably one or two names that are synonymous with vacuum. Back in the day, it was Hoover. Today, it's Dyson. I'm Erin from Tech Gadgets Canada and TechGadgetsInternational.com, and Dyson's newest model is the V12 Detect Slim. I recently got my hands on one of these vacuums to test and review in my home. In this review, I'll tell you what you get, I'll show you how it works, talk about some of the new technology in here, and I'll let you know if I can recommend this for you. An early heads up, if you end up liking this video or finding it helpful to please hit that like button and consider becoming a subscriber. Both those things do help me keep making more videos that I hope everyone out there can watch, enjoy, and learn from. The Dyson V12 Detect Slim is a compact, cordless, laser-enabled stick vacuum that's designed to be a lighter and more portable option than the recent Dyson Outsize Absolute Plus, which I also reviewed earlier this year. This version weighs just under 5 pounds and it's made for small to medium-sized homes, according to Dyson. It has a modestly sized dustbin and cleaning heads and a single rechargeable battery with up to 60 minutes of runtime. There's also a new power on button that lets you click on and leave the vacuum running without needing to pull and hold a trigger, and this is a first for Dyson. All right, I'm all for continuous power since it does make vacuuming easier, but I actually don't like the location of the button here. It's awkward to push and you need to use another hand. A locking trigger down here would have made a lot of sense in my opinion, but I imagine I'll get used to this. In the box, you get a boatload of attachments. There's the main vacuum handle with the integrated dustbin and filtration, plus the small screen is also built into the back, and it shows a battery countdown timer and different cleaning modes. There are actually three main cleaning heads and several more accessories for cleaning, and let's take a closer look at each. First up is the detangling motor bar cleaning head. You could call this the main vacuum head, and while it's the same size and width as the other head, it is a bit bigger in diameter. It's able to automatically adjust power on different floor types, meaning you can deep clean between carpet and hard floors without needing to swap accessories. Plus, it has special detangling properties. There's what's called a hair removal veins that seem to almost comb any hair out of the brushes. The brushes also seem to have fewer lines of bristles, but they look like they might be a little thicker. Next up is the Laser Slim Fluffy Cleaner Head. With its astronaut meets puppy dog name, this brush sounds fun to use. It's definitely padded and fluffy, and it's made specifically for wood and tile floors because those fuzzy rollers can trap and inhale fine particles of dust thanks to anti-static fibers. Plus, this is where the lasers come in. When powered on, the head emits a horizontal green light laser that shines across your floors, bouncing off particles so you can see them better. We'll get to more on how this works in just a second. Finally, there is the hair screw tool, which has a cone-shaped brush bar that not only picks up longer hair or pet hair, but its shape is meant to prevent hair and thread and fibers from wrapping around the roller and creating tangles. Hair should eventually work its way off the brush end and into your dustbin. When it comes to the other attachments and accessories, there's a combination tool with brush, a crevice tool, a dusting brush, and some mounting hardware and clips that will let some tools ride along on the extension tube. All the parts, including your filter, are washable. The battery life on this vacuum is actually pretty reasonable. You should get about 60 minutes of runtime on a charge. Fully charging one of the batteries will take a lengthy four and a half hours though. Your battery life is displayed on the rear screen as a countdown clock. Another new feature on this vacuum is the data you get about what your vacuum is inhaling. Now on that rear info screen, you can also see a count and analysis of the type and size of dust particles that are coming in via Dyson's multi-stage filtration system. Dyson boasts its filter is fully sealed and traps 99.99% .99 of microscopic particles and allergens. Okay, let's get to the cleaning with the Dyson V12 Detect Slim. This vacuum is really easy to use. It's light, yet it feels like it's doing a pretty solid job. You can use the attachments on the end of the extension tube or plugged right into the dustbin handle for a more handheld style vacuum. The accessories and brush and roller heads snap in and out easily with no pulling or yanking. To really test it, I spilled things like crackers, oatmeal, and flour on both carpet and hard floors, and I found it does a great job picking up pretty much everything. 
The Dyson V12 Detect Slim cleaned all the surfaces of my home really well. It also noticeably increases suction when it detects it's on carpet to really deep clean the fibers. Now I did notice the vacuum often stalls on very flat rugs, like ruggable rugs. This is something I've seen in Dyson's before where it seems like it's so powerful that it lifts the rug surface up into the beater bar and that stops it from spinning. So it's not great on these kinds of rugs, but traditional carpets and rugs with pile, it doesn't seem to have any problems with. On hard floors, it easily pulls up pet hair, crumbs, lint, and dust. The cleaner head is also small enough to fit under kick plates in the kitchen, and it can duck under things like sofas and beds too. Now, you're probably wondering about that laser head and if it really works. I was really and truly surprised by the Laser Slim Fluffy Cleaner Head's prowess. To be honest, before my testing, I thought adding lasers to your vacuum was about as relevant as adding lasers to magpies. And I found when I reviewed the Dyson Outsize Absolute, the laser does actually an outstanding job of illuminating dirt I definitely couldn't see. It shines across the floor's surface at an oblique angle, which is perfectly suited for making dirt specks and even tiny dust bunnies light up like traffic lights. It truly did make hard to spot dirt easy to see both in low light and bright light. The hair screw tool also worked outstandingly well. After using it on our dog bed, some furniture, and even testing it on carpet, the conical brush had absolutely zero hair wrapped around it. One of the nice features about the Dyson V12 Detect Slim that carries over from other Dyson vacuums is the point and shoot bin emptying feature. After detaching your tools, just give the lever a push to flip open the base of the dustbin and all the dirt falls right into your garbage. Overall, the Dyson V12 Detect Slim is a fantastic compact stick vacuum. When it comes to the pros, it's powerful, it has automatically adjustable suction, and a great array of tools and accessories are included. Plus, there is really good battery life, and that laser sighting actually works wonders. I also thought the new mini hair screw tool doesn't tangle and does a really effective job. Any downsides? Well, given its size, and I'll just pop it back up in here, the dustbin does fill up kind of quickly. Um, at least it does in our two dog home. Plus it takes a while to charge and yes, the vacuum is expensive. Even so, it cleans extremely well and I can't make any major complaints about it. If you need a light and compact new vacuum with the power of an upright, amazing new useful cleaning heads and without the trailing cords, this stick vacuum has the ability to clean pretty much your entire home. The Dyson V12 Detect Slim sells for about 849 Canadian dollars and you can get it directly from Dyson. Need a bigger vacuum option? I reviewed the Dyson Outsize with this laser technology and you can watch that review here on the channel or check out a steam cleaning option for your floors that promises deep clean and sanitization.